Hey guys, welcome back to RC. So in the previous video, we did an actual test to show you the low voltage cutoff of the REST V3 remote. And in this video, we're going to show you the low voltage cutoff of the REST V3 receiver instead. You can check out the previous video in the link in the description. So you may know that the REST V3 receiver has a voltage cutoff of 6 volt for 2 cell and voltage cutoff of 10 volt for 3 cell. So we have a voltage regulator here that can output the desired voltage that we want. So this will act as a battery to supply the power to the receiver inside. We have a C54 with a REST V3 over here. We have set 8.4 volt to simulate a fully charged 2 cell battery. Now we're going to turn on the vehicle. Light blinking. We're going to turn on the remote and bind. So I'm able to start the engine. So my throttle works for fully charged battery. Now I'm going to set it to, for example, 7.5 volt. Throttle is still working. There's no voltage cut yet. Let's try 7 volt. Our throttle is still working. And now let's try 6.2. Engine still running. Our throttle is still working. Now let's try 6.0. Press V3 immediately goes into low voltage cut mode and my throttle doesn't work anymore. That's why the throttle sound still there but it will kill off itself after a few moments. So I'm not able to trigger my throttle at all. It's in a low voltage cutoff status. So what you gotta do? Give it a new battery. Now I'm gonna show you a 3 cell setup at 12.6 volt, which means uh, 4.2 times 3. 3 cell, 12.6 volt. So let's try it, turn it on. So this is a fully charged 3 cell battery test. Turn on the remote, bind, throttle, so it works. Now let's try 11.5 volt. Headlight still solid, we are not in a throttle cut mode. Throttle still working, in fact very powerful. Now just jump. Now let's try 10.5 volt. Alright, throttle still working, we have to be really careful and let's put it to 10 volt, which is our voltage cut threshold. So headlight immediately starts blinking and throttle doesn't work anymore. So after a few seconds, the engine sound will go off, but steering still working, throttle not working, that means you are in a low voltage cut state. So you may have experienced this before whereby after around 20 minutes of playing, your headlight goes into blinking mode and your throttle doesn't work anymore but your steering still working. This is most likely that your REST V3 has gone into a low voltage cut status because these LiPo battery, they have a minimum uh, working voltage. Dropping beyond that, it will kill the battery. So REST V3 has already built in low voltage cutoff. You do not need to go with this bulky low voltage buzzer anymore. Yes! So I hope you find this video interesting. According to YouTube, there are 95% of you guys who didn't subscribe. If you like this video, please click the like and subscribe button and I'll see you on the next video. Bye!